Hey guys, we're back. We're out at another cell site here. There's something different about this one. You can see all behind this uh, wooden walls. We got a ladder set up, lights up there, because that is a live AM tower. And yes, when they say high voltage, they mean it. So we've talked to the radio tech. He just uh, he just blocked all transmitters. And our technician here, he's going through the job safety analysis, making sure we get that done before we do any work. Some very steep stairs. Got to crawl through this hatch and some stairs to get up here. Now let's add a little light to this. Okay. Got a radio cabinet. Got some other radios over here. Light set up because we're gonna have to put a, a lockout grounding on the base of that tower. Even though it's turned off. Even though it's turned off, there might be some residual power or induction from other areas. One of the reasons we're here, inside this box where the light's shining, is where all the cables come out. And this is an induction box. It reduces all the electricity coming off of that, that tower, which is powered, before those cables bring the power to the, uh, the radios here. We don't want to fry those radios. Very obvious. So, what we got to do here, uh, those jumper cables, you got to take those jumper cables and anchor them from the tower down to the grounding grid. See if we can do that now. Walls, underground utilities, elevation site terrain, holes, trenches, confined spaces behind the indu inverter or behind the inducer. Stairs and placement are secured but are slippery. There are telecom fiber optics cables, copper cables, DC batteries, power distributions, blah, 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 all through. Health hazards, EMF, RF, and then there's an asterisk AM tower output being shut down 10 p.m. to 5 a.m. And safety control items, all the normal PPE, which we understand. Da -da -da, no working aloft. Jump cables. There we go. I wish I had something to hang on to so I don't go through this. Yeah, you're just gonna have to skip across. You just clamping it to the cage? Uh, the strip here. Oh, the strip. Oh, there's. Oh, right, right, right. Of course. Good. He's done his job and it's powered off completely. Nice. On some of them, you put this close like this, it'll actually arc out between there. And you can hear the uh, radio station. Oh yeah. In this case. This is grounded on top to bottom. All this radial grid goes down over into the grounding. So he's, he's uh, blocked the transmitters, turned off the breakers, and for backup, we've also grounded the tower. Now we're good to go and work on the induction coil where the, we know there's a fault inside. Let's go take a look in there. <laughs> 